Hey guys, I'm Virginia Monet and I'm in Swing Festival with various creatives. Hi there, you alright, Virginia? How are you? you alright? Fine, how are you? Yeah, good, thanks. You're performing in a few hours. I guess you'll be excited about tonight. Yeah, no, very excited. Um, we're playing down uh, down the road later on. So, um, yeah, I've, ne- I've actually never been to Cardiff before. So this is my first time in Cardiff and also my first show in Wales, I think. Oh, that's interesting. But this is not, this is not your first festival. No, no, we've, we've, we've been doing festivals all summer. So this is, yeah, this is the last festival of the year. Okay. For us. But do you still get nervous before a gig? I get more nervous about interviews than gigs. Oh. <laughs> That's good to know. I also get nervous. Yeah. <laughs> Do you have any fun or unforgettable anecdotes about festivals? Um, so far, we, uh, it's, it's normally me that doesn't get involved in things. It's normally the rest of the band. Um, they tend to just leave me and go off and, and get into scrapes and things. And I tend to just... I, I'm always sort of like waiting on my own at the end of festivals, just waiting for them to come back from... Uh, the scrapes that they get up to. <laughs> so tell me about various cruelties. What brought you together to form a band? Um, well, it's a while ago now. It's it's like it's probably getting on for sort of two years ago that we formed, um, and we were. I was I was like demoing some songs in a studio in London, and I heard I heard this like what that like wailing guitar player next door, and I saw this. Um, like this guy with dreadlocks as well, who's our, who became, later became our bass player, and they were sort of in on another session. And I, honestly, I heard them through the wall. It was kind of, um, I was like, who's that playing next door? And um, yeah, I just got chatting to them, and they were sort of interested in what I was doing. And from that, we started jamming together, and yeah, we, we um, ended up recording a couple of demos. And yeah, that later became various cruelties. Wow, that's good. I read there's also an interesting story about the name of the band. Yeah, no, the name of the band is from a painting uh, by an, art- an American artist called Ed Ruscha. Uh, and he was a pop artist around the same, same time as Andy Warhol and people like that. And I'd never heard of him at all, but I just I, I saw the painting one day and um, the name Various Cruelties um, sort of just, I don't know, for some reason it resonated with me and it just seemed to encapsulate um, kind of the things I was doing at the time and the songs I was writing. So I just thought it would be a good name for a band. How would you define your music? Um, well, I guess I guess some people would call it sort of like a, a generic indie type thing, but I, w- I think there's definite elements of soul and um, possibly even like sort of I don't know funk. I don't. I hate the word funk in general, but some people have called it that. So maybe that's in there as well. I don't know. Have you always wanted to make a career in the music industry? Um. Well, yes, I would like to make a career in the music industry. Um, yeah, I, I guess, I guess, like you know, I've all, you know, I've always been excited about music, and always, I remember the first times that you know, I, I listened to records, and you know, growing up and, and and hearing like the latest bands that were coming out, you know, it was that that sort of excitement. I, I think it's kind of the reason why everybody likes music, and and like I'm just excited about new acts as I ever was, you know. So, yeah, I guess, I guess that excitement about music never changes. Okay. Uh, what songs inspire? What do you? What's your inspiration for writing it? Oh, that's difficult to say. Um, like obviously, like you know, you know, there's, there's there's so many artists out there that I kind of I've, I've been you know interested by. I said even new bands. I, I hear I hear songs every day that I wish I'd written. You know. Um, so yeah, I mean, I, I don't know. Which songs brings you the best memories or reminds you of a special person? I remember hearing like um, like Percy Sledge, Dark End of the Street, uh, when I was a kid, and thinking that that was like pretty um, pretty amazing. Um, like my parents used to play it and stuff like that. So that was one of the first songs that I heard that was I was kind of thought, wow, look, listen to that vocal and listen to the essence of where that song's coming from. I thought it was pretty incredible. I've checked that you're quite active on Twitter. Do you Am I? Mm. <laughs> yeah, you are. Do you use social networks? to express your feelings or is it uh I just chat a lot of rubbish to be honest <laughs> with, generally um, yeah no I, I, I tend to chat about things that are going on um, um, yeah I, don't, I, I try not to be too serious on Twitter but yeah I guess I guess social media is a great way to sort of uh, communicate with your fans and let people know what you're doing yeah. so it's so important for a band like Various Cruelties to, to sort of you know keep involved and keep, keep the fans involved with what we're up to Okay, and finally, 
Do you have any plans for the future? Yeah, well, we're just at the moment we are like writing our next record and oh. uh, working on a whole batch of new songs. So, yeah, I just, I'm, you know, I'm. They're they're very they're kind of different to the first ones, um, because a lot of them were written before I even knew the band existed. You know, they were songs that I was just writing, but a lot of these uh, new songs are written with various cruelties in mind and. And yeah, they're a slightly new project, and I, you know, I hope I hope when people finally get to hear them, that they're definitely people will be excited by them. When will we see the next album then? Uh, well, whenever I finish it, <laughs> but I don't know when that will be. Just now. Okay, thank you for your time. Thank you Enjoy very much. Soon. Cheers. Best thank you. Bad.